Well, Mentoring came in as the program. It's a program where we, we match up uh, year 10 and 11 students with the business and public sector leaders so that they get a bit different perspective on um, you know, the world of work, as also get to meet and discuss issues um, and ask questions of these business and, and government leaders. It's a great opportunity for them to kind of educate themselves about um, career paths. Um, different students, you know, they want to become lawyers, doctors, and they want to become automotive technicians. Whatever the career choice, we try to match the student up with a mentor who has similar career interests. What I'm involved in is the, um, the mentoring program that is run through the Chamber of Commerce, uh, supported by the Ministry of, uh, of Youth. And I uh, became involved because I want to uh, be a part of a, of a solution. Too often uh, we hear people talking about uh, young, young Caymanians not going off um, astray or not being focused or getting in themselves involved in illegal activities. And here's a chance for me to be part of the solution, to, to uh, work with a young man, to um, let him learn from, um, from me, and also I'm sure I can learn from him as well. So it's, it's so very important that I think that we get in, um, involved in these types of activities. Uh, also, I, I thought as the leader uh, in the civil service, the head of the civil service, it was something that I wanted to do, to lead by example. So um, I am doing it this year and next year. I'm going to insist that a number of civil servants uh, get involved. I think we have a very small number now of um, civil servants who are involved in the mentoring program, but I would like to see that number dramatically increase next year so that civil servants continue to be part of a solution. I got involved because my school director chose me and recommended me for the program, and so that was my initial involvement. And I, I didn't really know too much about it prior to that. And uh, when she chose me, I was really excited, and I had to write a, a little, a little paragraph explaining why I was interested, what I wanted, why, what I wanted to do, and what I wanted to be exposed to. And so I did that, and uh, and they accepted me, and they said, "Yeah, I'd be good for the program." And I was really excited because I had no idea who my mentor was going to be. It was all just like this big adventure coming into this new place and just learning whatever I could about whatever I was chosen, whoever mentored me could teach me. And um, so I became involved because I was chosen and then once I was in the program, I went, I believe it was last Thursday, to the Westin and I, I met Mr. Madison. And uh, we just got to talking and he's currently the acting governor and the deputy governor when he's not the acting governor. So. Um, First day on the job, the acting governor of the Cayman Islands is pretty cool. I'm, <laughs> what can I say? I'm, I'm really excited for it, and I've already learned so much in this first day about planning, goal setting, how to manage certain things. I've been toured around the building, and um, I just think it's a great opportunity for any student, regardless of who you're paired with, just absorb what knowledge you can and just further yourself, further your education any way you can. Well, the, the reason why we do the program really is a partnership between the government and the Chamber of Commerce. We started the program in 2002, and since that time, it's, it's, it's really a decade of put, matching up the students with, with the mentors, and we've seen relationships evolve. For the Chamber of Commerce and our membership, you know, we have nearly 700 businesses, and for those, they are always looking for the best talent that they can attract to their businesses. So for them, it's a great opportunity for them to meet some young Caymanians and residents who can basically assimilate into the workforce. They're going to be part of our community someday. So what better way to match them up than when they're in school and they're interested in different career opportunities? I'd just like to thank everybody getting involved in the program. Um, mentoring really is a powerful um, tool for change. And even, even in the private sector, without this program, mentoring in the workplace is really something that has, is really catching on. And we'd love to see more people get involved in the mentoring relationships. Again, next year we're always looking for mentors. So this year we were successful with 51 matchups, which is a record for the program. So again, if anybody's interested out there is watching this program, please give me a call, give Tiffany a call in my office, 
And if you want to become a mentor, we'd love to sign you up for next year.